Today we're going to start in Notability and I'm going to share with you how you can create password protected folders, how you put content into those folders, and how you make sure that folder is password protected when you leave your iPad. So let's go ahead and get started. The first thing we're going to do is look at the group of buttons up here in Notability and we're going to work with the plus button. So go ahead and touch on plus and to create that folder, it's called a subject in Notability. So just touch Create Subject, and then let's just name it period one and your name. So whichever class period you have, you just go ahead and name your folder. Now that you have a folder, just touch on that folder. And then, now that we're on that folder, go ahead and touch on edit and edit is found up in that upper left hand corner. Notice now you have a little settings gear next to all of the folders. So go ahead and touch on the settings gear and notice that you have now choices that you can change the name, the color, or we're going to focus on password today. Then you just go ahead and type in a password and I'm going to type in password for my password. Now, never use password as a password because that's one that everyone tries. But I'm going to just use it for our example today. And then I'm going to close out of it. Now, notice that there's a little password icon next to my password protected folders. So now what's really easy to do is you just touch on that folder to put content in that folder. It will prompt you for your password and you say OK. And now you are in your folder. If you would like to take a note and drop it into your folder, you can go here to your notes, grab a document, and drag it over and it will highlight and just drop right into your folder. Now, that when you're finished, notice that now your folder is unlocked. So to make sure that it's locked again is just touching on that lock icon and then that locks your folder. If you try to drag something to, into a folder that's locked, notice how you're getting that forbidden symbol. So it will not allow me to drop anything into that folder while it's locked. So the only way in that folder is to touch on the folder, type in your password, and then you can work by going into the unfiled notes or all notes and you can drag your document into that folder. So now once I drag it in here, and then I lock it back up. Notice now that if I go into my all notes, I have some files that are coming up with padlocks on them. And that means that they are in password protected folders so no one can see the content on those notes.